Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> for this one. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles, just absurd, and a heart got to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. Kick to the body by Lee. Quick jab lands here. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Straight punch there again. Been there all night. Oh, misses with the jab. Lee gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Nice target change with him attacking the body. Fighter lands a kick now. Roundhouse kick. Style points on that one. Jab is on point right now. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Landed a solid punch there. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. Two minutes have gone by here, round one. Beautiful kick lands there. Found the target with that left hand. Soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Just over two minutes now to go. And that one certainly found the target. Another hook lands there by Lee. Nice body shot. Slips the punch. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds.
just misses with that one. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Nice head kick. to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Under a minute to go. Right on the button. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Trying to establish that jab once again. Beautiful body kick. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. 15 seconds. Oh, there's the head kick. It's blocked. So what a round it was for him, particularly when it comes to those body kicks, DC. Landed those body kicks every single time he threw them. Every time he decided body kick is going to be the strike, it landed. His opponent needs to do something different, or this fight is not going to last much longer. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. All right, here we go with our next round, DC. Pretty good game plan in the previous round. Attacked the body to great effect, and we'll look to continue to do so here. He has done a great job of making the investment. The investment to the body that may not pay dividends early, but as the fight goes long, you will see it start to pay itself off. Nice punch there by Lee. Fighters starting to open up a little bit. Defense. He's looking to land the right just out of range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Oh, strong hook to the head there by Lee. He's found his range. Now he's in a rhythm landing those nice, beautiful punches. Watch knees to the body. Oh, that right hand barely missed there. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, he lands another debilitating strike to the body, and he continues to punish his opponent's midsection. Had a lot of success with it in the previous round, and picking up exactly where he left off. Under three minutes here to go in the round. Unable to connect with a right hook. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Oh, he caught the kick and now counters with the takedown. Heady stuff there. Oh, he did a great job of reversing the position, using the opening that his opponent gave him to shut him off and get back up. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Oh, a nice 
nice inside leg kick landed there by Lee. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start checking kicks. It's a nice jab by him there. Under two minutes here to go round two. Straight right, he misses. Both guys appeared to land there. Not there. Well, the more things change, the more they stay the same. He continues to land a high volume of strikes on his opponent at will. Well, I mean, John, the guy can fight everywhere. And he can fight everywhere, meaning... He can fight on the ground, he can fight in the stand-up, but he's also able to do it because his cardio is so good. Right. This is one of the best fighters that we have seen for a long time, and it is showing in this performance. Out of range with that kick attempt. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following a game plan, and it's working. Well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Fighter clinches now. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Was able to get that one blocked. Final seconds here of round two. Downstairs with the kick. Good round. All right, buddy, take a seat. Breathe and relax. I need you to suck it up this round, okay? You're missing those takedowns because you're not setting them up. You can see them coming a mile away. All right, we now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. You ready? You ready? Good Third round underway. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as they go forward. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. Inside leg kick is good. Oh, he continues to attack the body yet again here, just as he did in the previous round. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Well, the most significant stat in this fight, and you can see it right there in plain sight, bottom of your screen, the body strikes. His opponent has had absolutely no answer. He hasn't lowered his guard with the elbow whatsoever, and I'm not sure how many strikes to the body he can take before he ends up crippling here. We'll see. Oh, nice straight punch there by Lee. Just out of range with that right hand. no good. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Just misses with the left hook. Lee's body getting all sorts of bruised up on that right side now. Come on, buddy. Keep your hands up. Let's go. Just over three minutes to go. Fourth we go. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. 
beautiful job getting those hands up. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Misses with the left hook. We have crossed the midpoint of this fight. Oh, how clean is that? Nice strike. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Oh, right hook attempt. No good. Well, we're in the clinch, but still able to land hard to the head with the punch there. Nice display of technique by him there on the sidekick. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Very traditional technique that a lot of guys are using now in the UFC. Oh, great head movement there. Slips his head off the center line, and defensively, that's exactly what you're looking for. It's almost like he can telegraph when the punch is coming. And when he sees it, he just makes a slight little movement, right or left, to get out of the way and avoid those shots. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive. Oh, huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh! Beautiful jab lands. Under a minute now to go in the round. Kick attempt, that one was blocked. Well, he's... Oh, I think he's still compromised. We'll see if he can recover here. He's in a world of trouble. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. That is a damaging kick that lands. Man, his body not looking too good right now. It's not quite Dominic Reyes against Jan Bohovic, but these body strikes really starting to add up. They're starting to pay dividends. You know, he spoke to us about this earlier in the week, how he was going to eat this guy up from bottom to top. He was going to go in reverse. That is exactly what he has done. Uh, and that'll do it. 15 uh, minutes uh, from the books. Stop, stop, stop. All right, sit down. Deep breath, for me. Big breath, slow that heart rate down. Everything you're throwing is working, okay? Everything. Let's stay heavy. Well, he certainly added to his highlight reel in that previous round, DC. A lot of effective kicks there to the body. And he did a great job of setting up those kicks. He's not throwing blind body kicks. He's not just throwing the kick. He's throwing it behind jabs. He's throwing it behind punches, making his opponent think high, and then blasting that kick right into his opponent's body. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets over. I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. What a beautiful high kick that landed there. I can't believe he's still standing after taking another massive head kick. Head kick blocked. Right there, his opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Leg kick now. Nice knee to the midsection there. Cardio looks great. He's still bouncing. He's still moving. He's still real confident. He's got to try to finish here. Sidekick lands. Oh, man. Back. Oh. Nice 
Nice defense. He got his hands up and he blocked it. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Just over three minutes now to go. Effective use of the jab there by Lee. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I gotta protect my head at all costs. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is. It's got to change something. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh my goodness. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Oh, once again, kick to the body is there. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Man, has his chin been tested in. Oh, solid kicks are landing. He has most certainly found the range on the feet. Under two minutes now to go. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. In terms of those low leg kicks, a lot of fighters say it's just toughness. It doesn't have to do with genetics necessarily, but you don't want to take too many more of those. Quick jab. Well, he has got to be thrilled with this effort here tonight. There was a lot of pressure on him coming in. He has doled out a lot of damage, landed a lot of strikes, near flawless execution. Sometimes the hardest thing to do is what's expected. When you're expected to win, sometimes it's hard to live up to that expectation. He lived up to that expectation, and he exceeded it with such a great performance. Well, missed on that one. Under a minute to go. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys going out a lot. Oh! He's hurt so bad. He's got to find safety. Find a way that you can recover. Oh, big left hook there. Whiffs on the straight right hand. And now a head kick to boot. 30 seconds to go in the round. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. 15 seconds. Oh, lands a nice straight. Round four. All right, great round, great round, bud. Relax, take a deep breath and listen. You are out striking this guy. He's trying to make this an ugly fight, though. Don't get sucked in. All right, a lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my telestrator right now. That was a great display of high level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe to toe and let it all hang out. You ready to fight? Ready. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. All right, folks, here we go with our next round. And in terms of his output and his efficiency with his significant strikes in the previous round, you can argue that was the best five-minute stretch of his UFC career. Oh, absolutely the best five minutes he has ever had. He was in a zone. Everything he threw was just landing and landing with vicious intent. He's got to feel confident as he gets off the stool for the beginning of this round. Oh, spinning heel kick, and it lands. Back to the jab now. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Back and forth we go. It's beautiful kick lands. Let's go. Keep moving forward now. 
table inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good time that that landed. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, with authority, the body. He was breathing pretty heavy. Oh. oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. It's a right hand. Lee's got a nasty bruise, Daniel. You see that wound there on the left side. You got to think all of that body investment by his opponent is going to pay large dividends as this fight continues. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. Nice jab. He's got to find a way to finish this fight. The cut has just opened up now on his forehead. Hands up. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Nice job paying attention on the defensive side. He lands another head kick. Oh, nice right hand. Two minutes now to go in the fight. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Nice block. Oh, making this clinch work count. Lands the punch there. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Nice body shot. Oh, one more to the body for good measure. Oh. Oh, nice. Nice. Right hook to the head block. Head off the center line, slips the punch. One minute to go in the fight. Now lands a solid punch there. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. All sorts of bruised up on that right side right now. It's kind of hard to look at, Daniel. Good combination there. Great defensive skills. He blocked that punch. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Look at how he drives the knee. Separate. All back and forth action right till the final horn. What a tremendous finish to this one as we go the full 25 minutes. All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining to watch someone be in such a great state of flow, a great flow state in regards to the stand-up. He said that tonight we would be very impressed with his performance, and I am thoroughly impressed. Official decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! 
So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC.